Now the second step of arching is for us to scrape our egg into the paper. We scrape our eggs into the paper. We've already scraped it. We scrape it from your eggs or from your egg connector with a knife into the paper. Once you can see it is on the paper. On the paper, it was on the paper based on the size of the container that we are using. Now we now as usual we now introduce our fermented feed into our bowl. You can see to this our fermented feed. Don't let it be too dry and it should not be too wet. If it is too wet or too watery, once the egg falls into a watery subscript or a, a watery feed, that be what we call self harvest. The actually might there will be a mortality in the our hatchness. That's it. Don't let it be too deep. Because our once they arch, they are very shy little insects. They eat from the below of the feed. They will go down into the source. That's why we we, we we don't make the feet to be the feet to be too deep. What we are doing is just to make them have a soft landing. To make them have a soft landing. Now this is our feet. Now we now use small nets. You can use mosquito net. You can use all these five mm or three mm nets. You now place it on the feet. You now place it on the feet like this. You now place it on the feet. Now place it on the feet. Once you place it on the feet like this, you now your scrapped egg. Once your scrapped egg, you now place it on that iron net like this. As you can see. As soon there is a successful action, the once they turn into new nets, they will walk into the feed and start feeding. And start feeding. You can see there is something like arch arching on this egg before as we are making this our video. You can see very well. And see, we've seen some tiny timing that's a successful arch. And see, the new net is coming out. That is a guy successful arching of eggs. You can see very well. You can see small, small timing. This thing you can see. That is it. They will walk into the feed and they will start feeding immediately. And don't forget, don't forget after that, you cover it with nets. You cover your thing with net. Because all the feed we are using are fermented feed to prevent house fly from coming into our our um, our new net. That's it. As you can see. As you can see.